What is up, everybody? This is Lewis Baker checking in for the wrestling lunch break. Trying to get my lighting down a little bit. Trying to figure this out. But uh, I am excited to be back with everyone uh, for this next summer. Um, really what I'd like to do is just kind of introduce Wrestling Lunch Break, um, give you guys a uh, first little intro lesson, we'll get some stance in motion, um, and, uh, and give you guys the, uh, the schedule. So, uh, first of all, if you're watching, I want to say thank you. Um, this is the start of something that I hope um, continues through the whole entire summer. Uh, I've got some big plans for uh, just like last year getting some of the uh, best wrestling minds in our country to um, donate some of their time to help raise some money for charity and to help out uh, all of the wrestlers that have had a tough time uh, getting to practice getting a chance to work with their coaches, getting around the country to the tournament that they normally would have. Um, and, uh, you know, hopefully this gives you the opportunity to get some high level uh, and quality technique and coaching from some of the best people that we have. Uh, so uh, first things first, I wanted to start off with our schedule for the month of June. The month of June, we're gonna go Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Uh, at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 10 a.m. Pacific, and 4 p.m. Eastern Standard, 1 p.m. Pacific. So uh, one o'clock, whether you're on the East Coast or the West Coast, uh, we're gonna be having a session ready for you. Um, and we're gonna go Tuesdays and Wednesdays through the whole month of June. Uh, for the month of July, we will be looking to go three days a week uh, I'm not exactly sure how many sessions per day, but at least one. And we're gonna be going Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday uh, through the month of July. Um, maybe some timing and schedule uh, moving around, especially around things like Fargo. Uh, but I wanna try and make sure that I get you guys some quality technique at least once a day during the month of July. Uh, and then August, uh, I want to make our big month um, and go five days a week uh, for the month of August. I'd love to be able to give you guys um, access to, you know, uh, about 22 different coaches during the month of August. So uh, hopefully uh, that plan can kind of come to fruition and uh, we can have a great summer where we raise a bunch of money for charity, uh, are able to get some great wrestling content put together, and are hopefully uh, able to help you, the wrestlers, um, learn something that you haven't learned, connect with a coach that you haven't so connected with, um, and uh, just get better at wrestling. Really, that's all we're here to do, uh, is, is just kind of get better day by day whether that be getting better in the weight room, getting better with our nutrition, getting better with our technique, um, any of those things are gonna help to create a better wrestler and a better person. So uh, just wanted to get started right now. We're about six minutes in. We've got a couple of people signed in to this very first video of the 2021 uh, wrestling lunch break. And uh, so what I want to get started with is just get started with a little bit of stance and motion, okay? So uh, the things to remember that are important about our stance are uh, we don't want to have our feet square, okay? So we want to make sure that we give ourselves a little bit of space to move. Uh, me personally, I am a left foot lead. So what I like to do is I like to line up my back foot with about the heel of my front foot, all right? So, right here, feet are square. I'm gonna slide my back foot right to about the heel of my front foot. All right, here, one second. I'm gonna play with the lighting just a little bit here. 
There we go. Much better lighting in here now. So, we've got our stance, all right? The seven basic skills of standing wrestling. It's gonna be something that, uh, if you've seen me before or if you see me again, it's something that I think are uh, of the utmost importance, all right? So first thing is gonna be our stance. Now, the second basic skill of standing wrestling is gonna be motion. And it is very important how we move because when we move, we don't wanna cross our feet as we move, okay? So we want to make sure that as we move, we move with our leg to the side that we want to go to first, all right? So if I want to move, this is going to be to my left. I step left, step right, step left, step right. When I'm moving back the other way, step right, step left, okay? So we've got stance and motion, all right? So remember, line up your back foot with your front heel. Make sure that your feet are just slightly wider than shoulder width apart all right and remember if you whichever direction you want to move you move that leg first all right now the third basic skill level change all right now this is one of the most important skills that we have all right so when we level change we want to make sure that our chest stays forward all right that we don't drop our shoulders okay this is not a level change when we Bend over at the waist. All right, this isn't a level change. To think of your level change as being the best, make sure you drop your back knee straight down. All right, so when I'm moving around, level change. Moving around, level change. Moving around, level change. All right, so stance, motion, level change. Fourth basic skill is our penetration step. Now, I've had the pleasure and opportunity of working with some great wrestlers, uh, some of the best wrestlers that we currently have in our country, uh, whether they be male or female. Uh, by living in the great state of Pennsylvania, I have access to great wrestlers and great coaches. I am so thankful for that. And one of the things that I've noticed is we really have a hard time getting our hips forward on our penetration steps, all right? So remember, when I take my penetration, I go knee over toe, knee goes over toe, my back foot steps up here, and my hips hinge forward, all right? So we go knee over toe, here, step up, hips hinge forward. When I penetrate, I want to make sure that my, my belt buckle all right, I want to make sure that my belt buckle goes forward, okay? So I penetrate there. Coming back through the screen, it's penetrate here, okay? So our four basic skills so far, stance, motion, level change, penetration, all right? Fifth skill is going to be our back arch. All right, now this comes from our warm-up here. Okay, we want to get our hips up and arch our backs. Okay, but that is also vitally important when we're taking our shots. When I take my shot, my position is going to decrease if I keep my back rounded here. All right. I have to keep my back arched as I shoot. Keeping my hips forward, hinged forward. All right, looking to go knee over toe so that I go in the direction that I'm shooting. All right, so remember, when we take a shot, I take my penetration step, knee over toe, hips hinged forward, keeping my back arched all right 
if I can keep my chest facing my opponent or even facing the ceiling, I'm going to be in much better position to score. All right. Stance, motion, level change, penetrate, back arch. All right. Now, the, the sixth step, the sixth basic skill that we're going to talk about is lift. All right. Now, when we're talking about lifting, let me grab my trusty super heavy dummy. Now, right here, this is my trusty dummy, okay? So, when we're taking our shots, we're getting into our opponent, all right? Keeping our hips up, our chest forward. When we lift, we lift up, up, just like we do when we step up out of our penetration shot. We lift up, all right? Now, whether or not I'm shooting a double, I'm shooting my single, get to my double here, get to my double, come straight up, all right? So, our skills, stance, motion, level change, penetration, body arch, lift. Our last basic skill is going to be our back step. All right? Now, this is not a back step. That is a backward step. Now, the wrestling basic skill back step is more like this. Toe behind and turn. All right? Step, toe behind and turn. Step, Toe behind, turn, okay? Seven basic skills. Stance, motion, level change, penetrate, body arch, lift, and back step. All right, let's start putting some of these together. Now, there are more than seven basic skills, okay? Some of the other ones that I like to include to create kind of a top 10 list are going to be Head, position, and hand fighting. Sprawls, okay? And fast feet. Now, as we're moving around, let's make sure that we're keeping some of the most basic things in our heads. If I want to move this way, I move this foot this way. Okay? When I want to move the other way, my other foot moves. Okay, so let's circle to the right. Circle to the left. And level change. Boom. Drop that back knee. All right. So come forward. Come back. Level change. Left. Right. Level change. Left. Right. Level change. Forward. Back. Level change. And penetrate. That means we go knee over toe. Knee over toe. Back foot steps up. Our hips hinge forward. There, all right? So we're doing seven basic skills. Stance, motion, level change, level change, penetrate, knee over toe, hinge forward. Stance, motion, level change, penetrate. Stance, motion, level change, penetrate. Stance, motion, level change, penetrate. All right, so keeping our hips forward. Moving, moving around. Check your level, all right? Whenever I'm in my stance, I want to make sure that my free hand can touch the mat. The hand in front of my lead leg, this is my home hand. The reason it's called the home hand is because it stays home. This is in charge of the first line of defense. All right, we've got our head and then our hands. And it's most important that I keep my home hand as my main line of defense 
defending my lead leg, okay? My backhand leg follows my opponent's movement. So, seven basic skills. Stance, motion, level change, level change, penetrate. Now, we don't really have much lift here. I don't have a partner today. But what we're going to add in is our back step, okay? So we're going to have six out of the seven basic skills right now. Stance, motion, level change, penetration, body arch, and back step, okay? The only one we're going to miss is lift. So, get into your stance, start moving around, level change, level change. Level change, penetrate, level change, penetrate, level change, penetrate, good. Now, as we're moving here still, all right, when I say motion and then back step, we go here and turn. Motion, back step, here, turn. Watch my feet, okay, watch my feet. Back step, here, turn, here, turn. The closer I get to my own heel, the tighter I turn. The reason this is gonna be important is, as we start to get into throw technique, if I step, step through nice and tight, when I turn, I get big throws, okay? Now, it's easier to get big throws with my little dummy, but today we're going to be keeping it nice and simple, all right? Introducing the seven basic skills and getting some, some motion down, getting our first workout in, all right? So, back in your stance, motion, level change, level change, level change, penetrate, good. Right foot lead, guys. Motion. Level change. Level change. Penetrate. Motion. Back step. Back step. Level change. Back step. Level change. Back step. Level change. Penetrate. Good. Stance. Motion. Level change. Level change, level change, penetrate. Good, now, take a break here for a second, catch your breath. So, our seven basic skills of standing wrestling. This is where everyone should start with their learning of what to do on their feet. Stance, motion, level change, penetration, body arch, lift, and back step. All right, your seven basic skills. Now, other ones that I had mentioned, all right? So remember, we've got our sprawls, where we keep our hips down, our knees off the mat, and we circle back up to our stance. We've got our hand fighting drills that we're gonna go on, we're gonna go over later this summer. But I just wanted to kind of introduce to you what wrestling lunch break is, give you guys your first good workout, give you guys somewhere to start with. Uh, later today, we've got from the West Coast, Mr. Joshua Nolan from Silver State Wrestling Academy. He is an alumni of Wrestling Lunch Break 2020. Uh, he is a phenomenal coach. He does a great job with his athletes. I've had the chance to see him now all over the country since since 2020 and into 2021 and this guy really knows his stuff so uh get ready for coach joshua nolan he's coming on at 4 p.m eastern time today 1 p.m pacific uh tomorrow we've got some more amazing content coming all right first from the state of new jersey at 1 p.m and then at 4 p.m We've got Coach DJ Bruce from Ohio. 
All right, former Virginia Tech standout, uh, national champion in both styles in Fargo. Uh, so freestyle and Greco-Roman. And uh, I just want to say just a really good and close friend of mine. Uh, the guy is top notch. So uh, we're just going to finish up with another uh, five minutes of stance in motion. Get the burn into your legs. Uh, get used to making sure that your stance is in the right place, that you're hinging your hips on your penetration, and that your back step looks pretty good. All right, so... Five more minutes of this. Remember, stance, a little more than shoulder width apart. Get you, you can pick a lead leg, all right? Me personally, I'm a left foot lead, so that means that my left foot stays forward, and my back foot, my right foot, the toe lines up right with about the heel of my lead leg, all right? How deep do I wanna get in my stance? I wanna drop my butt down so that my chest stays forward, all right? Now, we start to move. Remember, whichever direction we move, that's the leg that moves first. If I want to move to my left, which is this direction, I step left. If I want to move to the right, step right. All right, now when we level change, remember, level changes, dropping that back knee here. This is a level change. I can't bend at my shoulders or at the waist to level change. This isn't a level change. All right, this is not a level change. Unless our hips go lower, it's not a level change, all right? So, stance, motion, level change. When we penetrate, right here, my hips are back, my chest is on my thigh. This is no good. My chest has to come up, my hips hinge forward. There, all right? This is where all my shots want to come from. Hips forward, and then remember, knee over toe. All right, my knee goes over my toe, right at you. Here, back foot steps up, and then our, our fifth tool is lift. We come straight up. Stance, motion, level change, penetrate, lift. Straight up. See how I point my back toe? That lets me know that I'm lifting straight up in the air. Okay? Stance. Motion. Level change. Level change. Penetrate. Lift. Stance. Motion. Level change. Level change. Level change. Level change, penetrate, lift, and back step. Stance, motion, level change, level change, level change, penetrate, stance, motion, level change, penetrate, Stance, motion, back step, back step, level change, back step, level change, back step, penetrate. Good, a couple more minutes here, guys. Stance, motion. Remember, we can move our feet however we want. Our head stays up, our chest stays up, our home hand stays home, and our back hand does the reaching. Okay? Level change. Level change. Level change. Penetrate. Good. Keep moving, keep moving, keep your feet moving. Stance. Motion. Level change. Penetrate. Good. Last minute here, stance, motion, level change, back step, back step, penetrate, good. So, it's almost 1.30, all right? First workout is complete. Anyone that stayed on and watched and followed along, first of all, I want to say great job. Okay, this is the first of 
hopefully a great summer of wrestling content coming your way. Um, please make sure that you check out our highlighted charities for this month. Uh, they are the Travis Mannion Foundation, which is started by the family of a, uh, a former uh, service member who was also a high school and college wrestler. His name was Travis Mannion. He graduated from LaSalle College High School right outside of Philadelphia. Uh, he also wrestled for the U.S. Naval Academy down in Annapolis. Um, and uh, he was a contemporary of mine. And uh, it is, uh, you know, in the wake of Memorial Day and everything that's been going on in our country, I really hope that the people watching today, the, that the people watching today and coming back to watch this session later can uh, spare five or ten dollars for the Travis Mannion Foundation. Uh, the second charity that we're going to highlight for this month is Wrestle for Peace. Uh, it's a charity that is run through USA Wrestling and the US Wrestling Foundation, hoping to help those less fortunate around the world uh, find the greatest sport that we all know and love. So uh, this is the end of my first session. I want to say thank you for tuning in. Uh, stay tuned for more announcements, more stuff coming. Uh, feel free to reach out to me through messages, Facebook, Instagram, uh, YouTube. Uh, all of these videos this year will certainly be, I'll be doing my best. I'm a one-man show, trying to get them up on YouTube as quick as possible. So um, anyone out there who wants to help, please reach out. Anyone out there who's got suggestions or ideas, please reach out. Uh, and if you'd like to be a part of this as a coach, also please reach out. So uh, thank you very much for your time. Uh, I hope you guys learned something about our seven basic skills and some of the things um, that I think could really help you moving forward. And uh, I hope you tune back in at uh, 4 p.m. Eastern, 1 p.m. Pacific to watch Coach Joshua Nolan live from Nevada giving you some awesome stuff. Thank you. Have a great day.